So just as you can see, if you buy this type of ivermectin, it comes in two, two foods. We have the bigger one, which is this uh, 100 mil, uh, milligrams, 100 milliliters rather, yes. And then there's a small one, this one also, which is uh, only 10 milliliters. And for this, I can see maybe it's just a form of marketing strategy to allow you to buy more. I use the I first use a smaller one because I have to adjust it first. And with the dosage also, you can see from the pack. So this type of this, this type of ivermectin can be used to treat uh, both internal and then external parasites, especially the the worms. Okay, and with pigs as well, and camel as well. So with the dosage, you can see here that if you are using it for pigs, which I'm doing here, you need one mil per 33 live weight. But in my administration, you can see instead of the one mil, I gave 1.5 mil to each of the winners. And I did that because it has been over three months since they got deworned. So I decided to increase it to make sure it's effective. Okay, but in case you are also going by the one mil, you can mm -hmm. do it one mil. But in that case, you have to repeat the dosage at one week after giving the first one. But I don't want that to happen, so I just give them one point five at a go. And I use the same thing also for the uh, the sow. Yes, and for the sow, I give mm -hmm. two two point five milliliters because that one is heavier, more than uh, seventy kilograms. So I give it two point five milligrams milliliters rather okay uh -huh. so you have to get everything right if you buy it i always say if you buy the drugs try and then uh, read through the manuals and then the instructions follow as per the producer so if you want to go by the 33 mil that one like i said 33 kilogram per weight in that case you give one but if you it's been a while or a long time you gave the treatment it means you have to repeat it a week after the first one I'm looking at something here. You have uh, this, if you have to take care of it, it's a withdrawal period. Okay, and you can see for pigs, it's 18 days. And what this withdrawal period is telling you is that in case you want to sell the animal for slaughter after treatment, it should last at least 18 days before you sell the animal for slaughter. And the reason being that if you don't do that and people go to consume it, they happen, they end up taking a some of the, uh, the drugs, yes, they find some residue of the drugs in the, the meat, which is not good. So after treatment, treatment, you should wait for at least 18 days before you can take your pig to market for slaughter to be safe and then to protect your consumers, okay? And it also came with uh, the syringe. And then with the syringe, we said one time use, please. It doesn't cost much to buy this syringe, just one CD, you can get one, okay? So there's no need for you to wash it and reuse. After using, just discard the syringe and then buy new ones anytime you want to do. So today, this syringe is already used, so I'm going to discard it. And I think this is what I wanted you to know, okay? And in terms of the treatment, I didn't treat the mother here. Yes. <laughs> Okay, I didn't give her any treatment because I've also deworm, uh, I've also caused her already, so I don't want to do that and then to harm my, my development problems. So in that case, this one is not dewormed. I'm going to wait after it has delivered. That is where I will then deworm this particular cell here.